Okay, class. Assalamualaikum and good morning. Uh, is everyone here? Yes, sir. Assalam. Yes, sir. We are here, sir. Assalam. We are here. We are here. We are here, sir. Sorry, sir. <laughs> All right. So before we start, has anyone watched the movie Kite Runner? Uh, yes, sir. We, we have. Yes, yes. It was. It was a good was, movie, sir. It was, was inside food, good. sir. Oh, interesting, yeah. Right. Yes, interesting, sir. So, so is there any particular scene that you know that you like or? Uh, You know that you have anything that you can relate to. Oh well, can I start mine? Sure, sir. Sure. Of course. Can can. <laughs> mine was during the final act, lah. Uh, when Amir, the main character, goes into this mission to find his newly found nephew, and after he finds out that you know Hassan was his half brother, and he goes to this like spy mission, a sort of mission where. You know, he goes to this uh, his old hometown, and you know it's heart pounding because he literally in the Taliban's group uh, area, and while wearing a fake wig because you know he is not allowed to have clean shave, uh, sort of mustache and all that, and you know it it was great for me it was great, uh, seeing his childhood bully Asif, all grown up and still being a really terrible person. Well, you know, while trying to save uh, his nephew, it's it's heart wrenching. It's heart wrenching, heart wrenching. But you know, overall, the country was dead. No signs of happiness. Clearly, the after effect of war has taken a great toll on the on, on the on the country. And it's definitely tasting to say the least that you know it affects me that how terrible we know war as it is. And you know to see that his determination to go through all this hardship to find his family again, and you know that that hits differently for me. So how about any you guys? Like, you know, that's one of my favorite scene. So you know, so I did. Uh, if you if you can. Yes, sir. actually that's I have a few scene. scenes uh, that I like. Say, however, um, I think that actually my favorite scene is the part when uh, Ame put his new watch under Hassan's pillow. Uh, and after that, he actually told his father that uh, Hassan stole his uh, father's gift uh, for his birthday. Okay, uh, if we if we all uh, remember from the movie, uh, from the start until that scene, we know that uh, Amir father is very affectionate towards Hassan. He loves Hassan, uh, such as uh, they said just now. Uh, actually, Hassan is also. His son. Okay, this leads to Amir being jealous and envious towards uh, Hassan. Okay, the reason why I choose this scene is because um, I think this actually happened to everyone uh, who is not your friend. Uh, it could be your siblings. Okay, growing up uh, as an Asian, living in an uh, Asian household, parents tend to have uh, you know kind of favorite among children, among siblings. If you know, then you know lah. Okay. Uh, what we can see is uh, how a child such as Ami can get hurt from his own father's action or love towards other, and in this case, uh, his best friend Hassan. Okay, this jealousy that Amr has felt uh, led him to do something bad, or we can define it as an act of betrayal or sabotage toward his best friend. Okay, this leads to Hassan and his father leaving Ami's house, even after Ami's father had forgiven Hassan. However, as the story continues, we learn that even though Hassan was betrayed, he still regarded Ami uh, as his best friend. And furthermore, if Hassan didn't leave, the story couldn't progress as it is. So I think that uh, that is my favorite scene for the entire movie. Set. All right, I did. That was an interesting scene that you take from the story. Now let's move on to the issues. Like, what issues do you think like exist in the story that you have found? I, I mean, any, anything uh, that you want to add? Uh, y- yes, sir. I think I found one issue that a very serious one, which is uh, sexual harassment, sir. We can see from the scene when uh, Asif raped Hassan uh, in the alley and Ahmed saw it. So yeah, the issue is quite serious and big nowadays because it's happening everywhere, uh, workplace, school, office, and even in class. And as you all know, sexual harassment is an act that affects someone's emotion, someone's self-confidence, someone's pride. And it is a not a very not a good act. To to perform, and uh, people nowadays tend to take it as a joke, sir, because they thought that the act that they did 
were just a prank or jokes to other people because they feel like oh this is this is fine we can do this because yeah people are laughing after we did this uh, to relate to the issues uh, um, back in high school when I was uh, form one form two a junior uh, seniors uh, the seniors especially tend when they meet me and my friend when they meet us they tend to you know uh, spank our butt and touch our tits for example uh, men's tits so yeah. Um, they laugh after they did it. So uh, everyone were laughing because we, we thought that they just a prank because back in the, back back then I was not uh, educated enough. I was not uh, because that no about this issue. And then as I grew older, I learned that it was a sexual harassment. And back then I thought that it was fine because people are laughing after we did this. Uh, so yeah, so it was, it was a very uh, bad and serious action and it actually hurt our pride and self-confidence uh, after the seniors spank our back and everything. All right, that was interesting. Uh, like it's, it is a very serious topic, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's move on. Uh, Amir? Oh yeah, um, one of the issues that I can relate to is uh, religion abuse. In the movie, in the movie, in the movie, Asif became one of the head Taliban officers. He believed that what he was doing is right. For instance, killing innocent people. All of those are in the name of God. Well, I've been to this kind of phase. I mean, I, I'm not Asif, but I've seen people like this, uh, dictators. Um, when I was from three, all of, my, all of my batchmates were called and the reason why is because some of us ditched uh, Troy prayers. They wanted to make it as an example so that we won't do it again. Uh, and it ended, it ended up with one of my friends getting a free flight kick from one of our seniors. This is, this is not the way. If you want to uphold religion or if you want to teach uh, kids or students how to uh hold to religion it, there, there are ways and, and what is even more saddening for me is the one that authorized the meeting was an ustaz a warden mm. this, this is so this is so wrong I I, I I just don't think that you can use uh the name the, the name Islam or religion for your own interests and this kind of manipulation has to stop in order for people to actually accept what is Islam, accept what is your religion. Yeah, I think that is it for me. Thank you. Wow, damn, that's interesting. Oh, I like that take of yours. You know, it's it's true that you know even in our modern world, you have those so close-minded thinking. So, yeah, that's a good point. Thank you, Ame. So I think that's about it. I mean, there's no one else in the meet, anyways. I mean, like just like three students. Who am I going to ask anymore? So let's end the meeting there. Uh, thank you for uh, listening to the class, I guess, and participating. Uh, don't play your phone. Uh, and sign your attendance. And have a good day, everyone. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. I see, you, I see sir. you play your phone. Eh? <laughs> no, 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 sir. No, sir. No one play phone. No, sir. <laughs> All right. Thank so you. You, can go, you can go and fly and kill him, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, I can't go flying screen with <laughs> him. <laughs> thank you, sir. Alright, good day. Thank okay, you. Thank you. What up? Three, two, one, go. Okay, I did. that was an interesting you know, like, view and about the, you know, stories. Okay, stop it. <laughs> okay. One, let's go. Okay, okay, class. Let's go. Uh, is everyone here yet? Well, everyone? <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. sir. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right, okay, then. <laughs> so, before we start our class, uh, have anyone like watched the bird kite? Kite right now? Salawat. Good thing you're giving me bobo. Dude, that's <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>